Trevor CEO back with another video. And in this video, we're gonna be doing a vlog. I haven't dropped a video in a few days. So yeah, we about to go pick up a new car. I'm about to go show y'all a new car we're about to get for the rental car business. It's a Porsche, but y'all will see it once we get there. So I got my boy coming to pick me up. He actually downstairs right now, but yeah, we got a little man right there. Kane. 11.43, so yeah, we picking up brand new cars at 11.43 in the morning. <laughs> yeah, we got cars for days, man. Vlog's about Copy to go right crazy. He, he about to get us copyrighted. <laughs> I don't know, man. And as y'all know, I don't have to own a single car to start the rental car game. Like, we about to show y'all. We about to meet up with the owner. It's the owner? Yeah, it's the owner. We so in the to... JV right now. Yeah, actually the car that we're in right now isn't our car, but we can rent these cars out for profit. Very good, very good business model for people that's trying to get into the rental car game. They come to me, hey BR, can I use my credit or how do I get into the rental car game? And they don't understand that they literally don't need credit, they don't need cash. You just learn how to use your network just like we're doing here. This is a more higher end car. It's not an economy car, nothing like that. It's actually a Porsche. So as you can see, we're in. Okay. Well, y'all saw y'all saw from the beginning, but this is a Range Rover. So it's like we started with economy cars, Nissans, Toyotas, and stuff like that, and then we work our way up um, using our network because this rental car game. If you're not using Turo or any platform or nothing like that. I gotta get used to holding this camera but if you're not using no platform like that you basically gotta build up your network and that's how you're gonna get a lot of cars rented out and that's how you're gonna be getting a lot of cars coming in as far as you know joint venture deals but yeah yeah we'll cut the camera back on as soon as we get to this car y'all go see what we got he said i'm like buddy so we get to the car y'all buddy said you trying to party what he said, he he bringing the car Sunday. It's Thursday. It's Thursday. Might as well let me get the car right now. You can make money off that. Why would he make us drive way over here though? Bro, who you telling, bro? What was the point? He got a sixteen hundred dollar car note. And he got a five fifty two on a what is he got that? Got a five eighty. What's that? A Cayenne. Porsche Cayenne. Porsche Cayenne. Uh, a five eighty. A five eighty is a Mercedes. Mercedes five eighty. The one right underneath the Maybach. Damn. But yeah, y'all, ain't no way, ain't no way he paying sixteen hundred a month. Daily, he got in Chicago on a Porsche Cheyenne, Cayenne. What he do for work? You think tell me he he a he a uh, artist? Sixteen a month. Sixteen a month is crazy. That's bro. bad credit. That's bad credit. You know what he doing? Sixteen a month. 16 a month for a Porsche or a Porsche Cayenne is insane. I would have told her they could keep it. They could definitely keep it, y'all. Definitely. If y'all if y'all are buying a car, uh, make sure make sure y'all not get it messed over on, on the on the prices, man. I'll oh, go ahead. Hey, for YouTube. For the YouTube. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. I gotta cut the camera back off. <laughs> Buddy <laughs> Pan. Sixteen hundred a month. He needs Rubo Credit Consultants. If y'all need, if y'all need credit credit services, if y'all need credit help, y'all know this is what we started the rental car business off of credit. So if you don't have your credit right, Rubo Credit Consultants. But buddy need it bad. He needed it too bad. Y'all, y'all better tap in with me when it comes down to credit repair. Buddy's spending sixteen hundred a month, and his interest rate is probably twenty percent. What that means is majority of that money is going towards the bank and he's not even putting it towards the principal. Y'all, if y'all don't tap in the Rubo Credit Consultants, you're gonna be sitting here looking crazy like Buddy not cash flowing at all. It's gonna be hard to cash flow off that Porsche at 1600 a month. It's gonna be hard. <laughs> y'all, all of his money is going towards interest. Like literally, uh, a lot of credit card debt that y'all have is going towards yes. interest. Y'all not even paying on the credit card. Y'all gotta understand that when it comes to interest. Interest is a very, a very deep game when it comes to financing things, as far as credit cards, mortgages, auto loans, etc. All right, there we go. Cars getting stolen. You guys, our Toyota Camry just got stolen off of Turo. And here's the crazy thing: Turo, Turo's Apple's bugging.
second. So this is why you gotta stay on your P's and Q's when it comes to the car rental game, right? So the Toro Apple's bugging. I'm looking for the vehicle. The vehicle got a book in an hour. They never hit me up telling me nothing about the vehicle. So truth be told, the vehicle is just doing its own thing. It was supposed to come back literally a day after. So truth be told, somebody else booked after them. I'm trying to get a vehicle ready. I'm like, what a vehicle like? Long story short, I had to go to my messages just to find an actual trip receipt from Turo. The day Southwest was tripping. Lo and behold, she was a whole day late. Took my car straight to Florida. Put it in a <laughs> junkyard type joint. The repo man I'm looking for right now, he can't even find it. He can't even find it. Like, bro, I don't see it out here, bro. Like, she took it out of Florida? Here. She took it to Florida. She took it to Florida, bro. And I'm like, really? You gonna really do me dirty like that? And you ain't even got to park out the front. They chopping my car up right now, boy. She didn't, she didn't say nothing? Not at all. Hit her up and everything. She didn't reply back, no nothing. But when the car is stolen, y'all, we get it paid off, like... On Turo, if we can't get the car back, obviously they're gonna go through a whole bunch of extra stuff saying, Oh, we looking for the car, let's wait three months for it to pop up, and all this extra stuff. Probably what, what, what Turo say? Turo said they're gonna get you taken care of as usual. You know, Turo's always a good platform to get taken care of, it, 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 it's seamless. But if you want to make more money, you guys gotta tap into BR's private rental car blueprint. I don't, I don't like Turo, I don't teach Turo. Turo is training wheels, you know, so. I can, I can tell y'all how to run Turo. I actually had like three, four Turo accounts and they just keep getting like trashed. I don't know why. I think it's because I decline a lot of trips, but oh well, I don't I don't rent my cars out to everybody, so. Big discrimination at a car rental game. Big discrimination. We are going to discriminate. Keep that in mind, y'all. I'm I decline trips all day long, but at the end of the day, it's multiple ways to run out of vehicles, so. Just like my Jeep Cherokee today, it just got it just got extended for like three, four days. The insurance be the best be the best clients to run out to who are being paid out by insurance because the insurance is gonna be paying for the rental car. It's like the clients always complaining about payments, how they can't pay this and that. But when it comes to insurance claim and the car is being rented out through their insurance, it's easy. Easy money, especially when the car is constantly getting extended because it's still in the shop. Go ahead. Oh, look, with that being said, if you guys want to go and learn about getting your private car rental started, automated, and off the ground, make sure you guys tap into BR's private car rental blueprint. Yeah, I if got you not to. in, you are not ready to live. Do not get in the red trying to do this, right? So many people want to invest so much money into these vehicles, but you're not investing into the mentorship beforehand. Now, you fumble, you see you losing thousands of dollars, and you're in the red, you're feeling butthurt. Why would you not invest in yourself first and invest in your knowledge before you go and invest in the private car rental fleet? Tapping with you, boy. Yeah, y'all. So just follow me on Instagram. Y'all already, y'all probably know my Instagram. Every all socials be hard to see, yo. So if y'all want to learn, I got the free webinar coming too. So the webinar almost done. I've been building that for like keep straight. Nah, nigga. This dude, he got us all in the. This nigga be hard. He got us all in the. This nigga be hard. You talking about some key straight, let me try the car. Yeah. I'm over here trying to merge. This nigga talking about some key straight. Buddy, I don't like it. Tweaking. Come on, bro. I know he was in the back of my head. I really came over here and took over the city for real. Uh, for All gas, no brakes. All gas, no brakes. Let me see. Yeah. Buddy look like a lock character. Get your... Boy, you know, he look like an NPC, boy. Yo, had locked on the carrot. Uh, Hey, how are you today? Face that little ass and shit off of GTA. <laughs> oh, why the, why the camera keep getting darker and lighter? Because your ass too light. Yo, I light skin and hell. Look, you need to worry about the road, buddy. I am worried about the road. I'm a safe driver. Y'all got me looking like I'm not a safe driver. I'm the safest driver. Know the man. He finna get us pop. Boy, like a tire. Come on now. Look at the Houston traffic, y'all. Yeah, we in Houston. We get busy. Don't move to Houston if you can't be a big dog and can't run with us. Yeah, we in Houston. Let it be known. I gotta, I gotta tell y'all one thing. Why y'all on this platform? Why y'all on this YouTube thing? All right, y'all watching my videos? Stop moving to Houston. Stop. Because stay in California. No shade, Turner. No shade. No shade. No shade. It's twelve thirty nine, and it's this much traffic. It makes no sense. Like why? Why y'all keep moving to Houston? Y'all just keep causing all this traffic. Oh, this ruckus. We're going the right way? Yeah, we are. 
And folks be broke moving to Houston, bro. If your finances aren't in a line, please do not move to Houston. If you feel like you're going to get out here and try to hustle and grind and get it out the backbone, bro, your backbone going to break. Your spine going to fold. All right, you do not have the same type of muscles you think you had in the other state. You're going to have no motion. The bigger companies like me and BR are going to eat you up, and you're going to have to go right back. And it's okay, all right? But I always preach, do what your mileage can afford. But listen, if you're a mentee, gonna get you right. So go ahead and go ahead and lock into the rental car blueprint. Learn how to run the cars, learn how to market, learn how to network. Just like how we just got this Porsche. Like I said, the dude was like, oh, let's do it Sunday. It's Thursday right now. He's like, he got something to do, so come get it Sunday. I'm like, bro, we just drove way over here. But anyways, um, yeah, that car was basically a networking play, right? Because people know we rent out cars here. Um, and then my mentor was like, hey, this person is not the type of car that I would rent out. So he handed it to us. We take the lower end cars, which is cool because it's a Porsche. Like right now we in a Range Rover, like I said. So what did traffic still, yeah, yeah, the traffic I'm crazy. About, I'm about to get off, but this is the fun thing about knowing Houston. You gotta know exactly when to get off, where to go, how to move and how to operate. Cause y'all will get stuck in this traffic. You know Houston, huh, bro? I know Houston like the back of my hand. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> man, I stopped gassing them boys up, man. I ain't even bust no move yet. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. This is the worst driver I didn't nah, I ain't. Oh! They haven't driven with Turner yet? Stop playing. Turner drive better than you. No, you crazy. What, bro, Turner be? Turner drive better than you. Gas brake, gas brake, neck be whiplash. Bro. BR, BR, BR just drive fast, you feel me? BR just be trying to go fast. I be telling I drive, BR like, where you I drive going? fast when I got a fast car. Oh my Lord. Me, I'm the type of guy to drive a, I'm the type of guy got, about a fast car and drive slow. If I got a Lambo, I'ma drive the Lambo. If I got a Hellcat, I'ma drive it like it's a Hellcat. If I got a Range Rover, I'ma drive it like it's a Range Rover. Benz, drive it like it's a Benz. Can, can't y'all agree? What's the point? What's the point of having a Audi R8, a Audi A4? I got an A, I got an Audi A4 Premium Plus Quattro. You hear me? That way on the live flex. Hey, hey, that my boy hey. right now. Four wheel drive. Stop playing with him. He'll beat you off the all, mat. All wheel drive. Oh, I can't man. drive it like it's a it's a Mercedes. True, true, true. Unless it was an AMG Mercedes, but at the end of the day, I'm gonna drive a car like how it's supposed to be driven. Well, I had too bro, much. what you got? I had too much cinnamon what you got crunch going today. On, bro? I had too much cinnamon crunch crunch today. You feel me? These nice choppers. These ain't the veneers. These not the veneers. Get out of here. Face that boy head like a like a pea. Boy. That boy head like a bean, like a I kidney keep bean. Pee all the time. That boy head like a kidney bean. Hey Houston. Houston really the coldest city. But yeah, y'all. We're gonna see we gonna see what the next what the next spot talking about. You went the wrong way, bro. Oh bro, that's too much traffic going down that side too. He finna get us hit. Oh man. He finna get us pop. Look at him! Oh, look at him! <laughs> Look at this dude! If I know how to this drive, dude, this dude can't drive. If I know how to drive, we would've been fucked drive. up. If I know how to drive, this we would've been fucked up. Only, only, only if you would've just seen what just why, happened. Why, why was this nigga on my ass? Only like this? if y'all would've seen why what just happened. Why was this nigga on my ass like that? You, 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 you supposed to be shit out the car. Bro. You over here filming. Come on, bro. Bro. You supposed to be getting this cat ass. Cat was on my ass, bro. You know, you know how I be with them little And then they don't know exactly what they doing. All this whoop la. And all this job, bro, like, you trying to catch it. You trying to get an insurance claim. Like, come on, bro, stop playing. You better go hit that construction job, make some money. He's you go mad. You trying to get money off of me. Hold up, T, hold up. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. He was, he was driving crazy. Wow. He was driving, bro, he was on my, on my dope. You going? Hey, Pierre and BR Chronicles, That's to be continued. Right. Yes, sir, ski. All right, y'all, let me cut on this car. This is probably one of my favorite, one of the favorite cars in the fleet, y'all. Got the Infinity truck. This is definitely one of my favorite cars. All right, so, oh, we gotta cut that off, copyright. But yeah, y'all, it's almost a brand new car. 17,000 miles, right? This is definitely one of my favorite cars, but. Car note, super high, I got finessed. 
I got finesse in the game. I paid like a thousand dollars a month for this car. I got finesse when I got into the game, but yeah, yeah, we already in infinity, but we about to go get some food and y'all get in a little day in the life. So we went to go look at that car. We were supposed to take the car, but the client was tripping. He was acting like he don't know what was going on. So he wasn't prepared. So he's just gonna come back and get it on Sunday, like he said. And then, um, oh yeah, and the, and the dude's a party promoter. So I'm like, he got bad credit. He need to get his credit right. Like why, you can't be paying 1600 for for the type of car that, that uh, we was getting. Bro. Ain't no reason his car should be that loud. But yeah, y'all, um, we about to go get some food and I'll catch y'all when we get there. I know y'all couldn't see it, but when we was like, bro, really can't drive. Like he was about to get us in a wreck. So basically it was merging to get on the freeway, right? The little lane was merging. So he tried to speed up in front of this truck, right? And the truck like was not letting him through. So it's like, we both stuck in this one lane, like two cars in one lane. I'm like, bro, what are you doing? But yeah, he was about to, he was about to get us crushed. But um, I know y'all couldn't see it. So I had to explain what happened. But yeah, y'all, let me show y'all. This how the Infinity look. Super clean car. It got the full sunroof right here. Y'all can't really see it. Got the full sunroof. It's great for my little dog because he a Doberman. He's super big. But yeah, I love this car. Super luxury, right? Super comfortable. It got the bucket seats. Yeah, man. Y'all know what it is. I know y'all want something, though. But let me have a little pep talk with y'all right quick. All right, y'all. So, as y'all can see today, we would just go look at the car. It was a miscommunication or whatever. I guess with. Hold on. I guess I'm going to just leave the camera right there. But, like I was saying, miscommunication, I guess, with the client. We got there, he was like, oh, I got a party Sunday, so I gotta go do something with it. So, we're gonna go get the car Sunday. I am gonna record that, so if you wanna see the car, I know y'all wanna see the car, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Not only do I show y'all the lifestyle and what's going on, like with the rental car business, um, I got a lot of videos dropping, like with the credit repair business. Last month, the credit repair business did like 40,000. 40, yeah, 40,000. So I'm gonna be giving y'all like a lot of games. So I'm working on getting my first exotic car um, or my first personal exotic car because we have some in the fleet. But um, for the most part, I'm not just, you know, the entrepreneur that's just vlogging. I want to actually teach y'all how to do it. You know, um, I feel like when I watch a lot of these people on YouTube and stuff like that, they don't teach anybody. Oh, when they do teach them, it's not real game. Like, it's it's nothing you can do something with. It's just a lot of motivation. There's a lot of basic stuff. So, I'm not going to be that type of person. I'm going to actually be giving y'all as much game as possible. Without, um, you know, it, it's like you can go on my Instagram. It's a lot of free information. You can literally start a rental car business, credit repair business, just by going down my Instagram. But people are so lazy they don't want to do it. So here's the best thing to do. You join a mentorship, and this is just for anybody. Anybody that's selling a course. Hold on, let me close this. Uh, like get their course because all of their information is going to be compacted into one space. But like me, I teach my information in a rental car blueprint, right? And in a rental car blueprint, I teach credit. I teach credit repair. I teach business credit, personal credit. Then we get to the rental cars. We get to Turo and then all the other platforms, right? That you can rent out the car. Teach y'all how to finance the car correctly. And I get finesse so that y'all can rent the car out for profits, right? And then I teach y'all how to rent them out privately. So, and it's a community. So I teach a little bit different than everybody else, especially for the rental car space because I started off at 18 years old, well, actually 19 years old, and 
And being that young, it's hard to finance a lot of cars, and which I did. I financed a lot of cars. And a lot of people can't teach from my, from my perspective because everybody that's teaching a rental car game, they're 30, 40 years old. They're old heads, right? That's what we call old heads. So the old heads try to compete with BR, but little do they know, they didn't go the route that I took because they were going to Chase, Navy Federal, Bank of America, you know, all of these top dog banks that I couldn't go to. So now when I come to you guys and y'all can't go to the big banks because y'all have bad credit because y'all don't have any cash, which is okay, right? That's where I come in and say, hey, you're 18 years old, you're 19 years old, this is what you do, this is how I did it, boom, let's get it, all right? So, yeah, man, y'all gotta subscribe, this feel good, I'm sorry. Y'all gotta subscribe, y'all gotta get this information, y'all gotta see what's going on, y'all see the lifestyle. Um. A lot of a lot of videos to come because this is like I don't know like my 13th video I, I barely be posting but I'm gonna be a lot more consistent now that I do have you know the right teams and systems in place to actually run my business so I don't have to be there a hundred percent like I used to be now nah, don't get me wrong it's not easy at all Having over 30 plus cars, 30, 40 cars, having a credit repair business, and then content alone is its own business. This stuff is not easy, y'all. Y'all might look at entrepreneurship as you working for yourself, which, yeah, you are, but at the end of the day, it's a lot that come with it, especially if you're trying to grow. But if you're just an entrepreneur and you're trying to just stay at ten thousand dollars a month five thousand dollars a month you can do that but you will always want more so it's just not the type of mindsets that entrepreneurs have once you become an entrepreneur some people are meant for the nine to five some people like me are not meant for the nine to five i actually got fired i i had one nine to five i got fired in two weeks and it took me two weeks to get fired because I didn't like the way the, the, the lady was treating me like like I was just some punk, like I'm just some rag dog that you just, oh, go do this, do, do that, do that, do that, do that, do that. And I'm like, I was working in a warehouse. I'm like, this not even my area of the warehouse. Like you have me doing something else that I'm not being paid for. So I'm like, no, I told her, no, I'm not going to go do that. And she's like, okay, you can go home. I was like, all right, cool. And then I just never went back. So that's just how they do employees. That's just not me. I'm sure y'all are here for a reason and that's not y'all either. So it's pretty information out here on my Instagram, on my Twitter, inside of motivation on my Twitter, on my YouTube. Now I can get more interactional, in person, you know, close contact with y'all with the YouTube. That's why I took YouTube so I want to build an actual community instead of just having some people on Instagram that just follow me just because they like one video, right? I want to actually build a, a community of people that can actually, you know, grow. And that's what the rental car blueprint is. But for the most part, the free information is right here. going to be right here on YouTube. But I ain't going to lie, y'all. I can't eat and talk. So I'm going to get back to y'all when I finish this food. <sighs> All right, you guys, that's the end of this video. But go ahead and like and subscribe to this video, comment what y'all want next. Um, as y'all know, I'm new to this YouTube stuff, but I'm gonna be giving y'all a lot of sauce, a lot of information as my dog drinking in the toilet. Bro, what are you doing? Hey, he always be drinking in the toilet, but I be forgetting to close it. But anyways, y'all, go ahead and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, at BR the CEO. And I know I didn't get to show y'all the car. I was expecting to get the car today, but we didn't get the car. Um, we'll get it Sunday, whenever the owner is ready. So yeah, it's a very nice car. I saw it in person. You know, we checked it out, did the full 
video of everything, made sure the, the car was good to go with us. And then he was like, oh, well, I need y'all to take it Sunday. So we like, okay, cool. But yeah, y'all subscribe if y'all want to see any more rental car content, credit content, um, vlogs, day-to-day -day vlogs. Um, I might, I might hop into exotic here and there, but yeah, y'all see y'all on the next one.